it's November 9th, Monday. It's my 29th birthday today. I am all done getting ready for radio. I'm going a little early because I'm going to have dinner with my producer and writers and Key, I think. And I wanted to update you guys on the gift shopping. So the day after we went shopping, Joan went to Myeongdong by herself to the department store and got something for herself and for me. Next time, we're gonna prepare in advance. So mine ended up being a surprise. Joan, uh, we ended up getting her an iPad. Hopefully she can use it for her vlogs and for like entertainment purposes and have fun with it. The gift I got is the Chanel card wallet. It's so pretty. So Joan went to the Chanel store and picked this out for me. It's actually my first Chanel. So thank you to my friends who chipped in to get me this. So grateful. My mom also actually surprised me this morning with the plant. She sent over a plant at like 9 a.m. I had no idea, but every year she sends me like flowers or plants or cake. And I'm so grateful that she still takes care of me even though she's so far away in New York. Um, this is the plant she got me. I haven't decided where to put it yet. I'm not sure what this is called. I gotta ask her again. Thank you, Amma. I'm gonna take the cap today since it's my birthday. I can treat myself to that, right? And also it's freezing today, so I really don't feel like taking the subway. Anyways, let's go have dinner. We're gonna eat samgyeopsal. Yay! Hello! He's here now. Happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Happy birthday. 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 ちゃちゃちゃちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。ちゃちゃ。
Yeah, I wish it was a bit um, crunchier. Just the outsides. Should I throw them into the air fryer? It's good, but of course it doesn't compare to the ones in New York that I had. Maybe it got soggy on the way here. Let me try a mozzarella stick too. The mozzarella sticks are really good. Prince Charles over here is your drinking buddy. Again, fine. Uh, the Trump creativity. So I started learning Spanish again. I've always loved learning languages. Spanish was my favorite subject in school from seventh grade till I graduated high school. And after I came to Korea and became a trainee, I learned Japanese as well. So when I debuted with Ladies Code, they kind of pushed me as this global code, uh, quadrilingual girl. So I had to continue to practice my Spanish and Japanese because we would film like greetings in those languages. But I think towards the end of our uh, Ladies Code promotions, we kind of stopped doing them. So I'm kind of rusty now. It's quite embarrassing when someone says like, oh, I heard you speak four languages. I'm like, um, so when Rosetta Stone reached out to me to collaborate, I was so happy because I've known about Rosetta Stone since I was in the States and I kind of needed like a push to help me study and learn again. And I thought it'd be great for me to share this with you guys since a lot of you guys are studying Korean and Japanese and even English right now. And Rosetta Stone is great because you not only learn reading and writing, but the skills that you actually need, which is speaking. They have a speech recognition software, so you'll be talking in the lessons from day one. And it's super easy to learn anytime, anywhere, because you can learn through your desktop, your mobile, your tablet. Once you sign up, you have access to all these different languages on their website, not just one language. So after I kind of remind myself of Spanish, I can move on to Japanese. Japanese and study Japanese again. Disculpe, necesito medicamentos. Por qué mi paraguas viejo está roto? So if you guys are interested, Rosetta Stone is having their best deal of the year for Black Friday. Their lifetime subscription will be reduced to $189. If you guys are interested, I will leave the link in the description box below, so go check it out. And thank you so much to Rosetta Stone for sponsoring this video. I'm in Ejiro today. I'm going to get some pho. I'm trying this new place out called Chop Chop. Chop 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 Now that my stomach is full I'm gonna go check out a little uh, stationery store Mine things Oh so many stairs in her diddle Check out another lifestyle shop. It's called Grandma Cabin, and I think they have a lot of retro and vintage goods. <gasps> oh my god! Wow. You don't actually believe a single word I'm saying, do you? Oh sure, of course I believe you. Great. Just repeat the words I'm about to say. All right? Moon, prism, power, makeup. Right. Moon, prism, power, makeup. Oh. God. Oh my god. This is my childhood. Yeah. Card Captor Sakura. I have Wedding Peach. Everything Sailor Moon here. I have most of these though. <laughs> so, not too jealous of that, but these really vintage stuff. I used to love this. I'm so happy I went in because I got to see so many Sailor Moon stuff. It made me really nostalgic. Mm. Going to a cafe now called Pektu Gangsan. This is the only sign for the cafe. 
so you guys are gonna have a hard time finding it but I'll leave their Instagrams but it's literally in the middle of nowhere with no signs wow Now we're going to this place called Lemon. It's a retro gadget shop. They have um, goods from like the 70s, 90s. Unfortunately, we can't film inside, so I'm just gonna have to show you guys like pictures from their Instagram, but I'll let you guys know if I buy something, so let's go. They didn't have any of the turntables I wanted, like the portable ones, they were all sold out. So I just got an LP. This LP is a compilation of various artists from Asia, like Japan, Korea, Taiwan, and it's like lo-fi SoundCloud artists. All right, now I'm gonna go try to get an iPhone. Got my new iPhone, so sexy. So this is what the camera looks like. This is the iPhone 10. This is the iPhone 12. You can definitely see the difference. And this is the back camera. I'm filming myself on my new iPhone right now. Like you can see like every pore. So yeah, this is very realistic. The camera quality is insane. <laughs>